The last thing I want to talk about is grounding. And here's the idea. Let's say this is a live wire. <clears throat> that means it's just pure metal wire and there's no rubber insulator protecting you from getting shocked when you hold it. That's why we wrap wires in rubber, because rubber is a good insulator. Now this is a live wire with one, one billion volts of electricity running through it. And if this person's just hanging on to the electricity, to the wire, he's actually not going to get shocked. And it's not because his arms aren't attached to his body. Um, it's because electricity wants to take the easiest path to get to where it wants to go. The wire is a really good insulator. The, your body, especially your skin, is actually pretty protective against getting shocked. Um, when your skin gets wet, not so much. So the electricity is not going to go through the body for no reason at all. Now, this person's not touching the ground and that's why this is true. This is only true if you're not touching the ground. If we move the ground up, so the person's touching the ground, well, the ground is an infinite source of charge. This unbalance makes electricity move. It wants, electricity wants to equalize. And if there's a, it can travel miles to get to the other end of the equalization. But if this person's touching the ground, well, the electricity can now go to the ground to equalize itself. And bam, the current's going to go right through his body and he's going to get shocked because he's grounded. So this is why some plugs have these two prongs and some have three. This prong right here, one is a positive end, one is a negative end. Electricity comes in one end and goes out the other. And this one is your ground wire. Some things we really want to protect from static electricity building up, like your computers and your phones. So they have these third wires built in, and this allows static electricity to leave your computer or a really expensive appliance and go out of the house, and there's literally a piece of metal in each house sticking into the ground that all the ground wires in the house are attached to. And this lets charge leave things like our appliances so they don't get fried. We don't want our microwaves and our dishwashers and all the other stuff that run electricity to get shocked because they're building up charge inside. That's ground. So let's give you a definition. Grounding. The planned release of built up charge. So that uh, charge equal so member equalizes. This is what happened. This is all lightning is. It's just charge is building up in a cloud, and it's grounded, and the charge is gone, and we don't have any more lightning at least until more builds up.